Do you remember the bicycle shop that was next to the Gardener's Arms in London Road, on the other side of the road from the Swan? Ernie Chambers bicycle shop. I remember it from the 60s. And this photograph from the Bill Rudd collection on the Merton Historical Society's website is dated October 1975. But what do we know about Ernie Chambers? Well, the 1937 Mitcham Town Guide, it says, Ernie Chambers, cycle agent, 105 London Road, Mitcham, is a newly established business, but old in experience. So there you go, straight away from that piece of information we can tell that the business was established either in 1936 or 1937. Ernie Chambers, whom you can regard as your friend and advisor, has been in the cycle trade for many years and can back this up with a wealth of cycle racing experience vouched for by the fact that he has ridden for England in three Olympiads in 1928, 1932 and 1935, a record unequalled by any other cyclist. Here then is a real cyclist that understands a cyclist's needs. All the leading makes of cycles are stocked. Everything for the cyclist who uses his machine for business, touring, racing or pleasure. All repairs are promptly and skillfully executed on the premises, no job too large or too small. And in the same publication, the 1937 Town Guide to Bicham, is an advertisement. Early Chambers, 105 London Road, Mitcham. Phone, Mitcham, 2021. Cycles from two shillings a week. Accessories and clothing always in stock. Repairs of every description. And there's a photograph of Ernie Chambers riding a bicycle. And this photograph of the 1928 Amsterdam Olympic Games shows Ernie Chambers at the back of the tandem bicycle with Jack Sibbett in the front. The event being the tandem sprint, in which they came second. Silver medalists. And that shirt he's wearing matches what was in the advertisement from 1937. What does Wikipedia have to tell us? He was born in 1907 and he died in January 1985. It says he also competed at the 1936 Summer Olympics. Hope you found this video interesting and if you liked it, why not press the like button? And if you want to see more, why not subscribe? Thank you for watching.